grateful to have you in our lives we are so excited and today i just want to talk about the power of words sometimes we just speak unknowingly of what words are creating in Bilunze. even when we are writing messages and sending messages to our friends or to people we write things that are destroying us unknowingly because words are powerful do you know that even when you are quiet there are words there are speeches that you are saying to yourself what are you saying to yourself are you kind to yourself are you loving yourself are you supporting yourself are you encouraging yourself or are you expecting that to come from somebody else what if those people don't give you what you're expecting then you get disappointed but you can decide to encourage yourself to tell yourself you know girl you can do this thing you are more powerful than you can think you were born for success god loves you and he has got plans for your life and he you know there are open doors before you there is grace there is favor you know absolutely what you do is favored you know because what i'm it feels like i'm deceiving myself but the truth is you can choose to deceive yourself or maybe you can choose to tell the truth that destroys you but you can choose to deceive yourself while you are creating something better in your life or you can choose to speak the truth while you're destroying your life you're putting yourself in the pit which feels better which one is better me i choose to to encourage myself the words that comes from our mouth they are living they have the power to create but it depends what is it that you're creating you know i've realized to even talking about amakamabantu doesn't serve me so i don't do that sometimes again jangabantu say awenza loku tolu to discuss into that are not going well in your life because of course there are relationships that are connected to me and i'll find myself having to discuss those relationships especially if they are relationships that are not uh, in a good condition then i'll find myself uh, complaining about the behavior of a person how did this person do this why did this person think like this and then i realized that, you know what just i show you i suggest you know what whatever you think of saying you've already said it cancel but the truth is you need to be able to activate our senses when we're listening to people you listen beyond wrong words to express what they are feeling so it is important that we train ourselves to listen there's hearing when you can just hear but there's also listening when you go and you listen to the message that is being said listening to the words listening to the tone and also listening to a uh, body language and also with the spirit going to a beyond to a place of understanding make sure these are the words that you are read because what you send out comes back to you and also the words that you say something about somebody and then pretend otherwise as if you like the person or is if things are okay but the truth is what you carry in your heart will always be felt in the atmosphere pay attention to the words that we are saying influence it so words are very important what you say affects how you feel so let us hear what the bible says when it comes to the power of the word hebrews chapter 4 verse 12 for the word of god is living and active when we talk about the word of god for me it's also my word the word that comes from my mouth mind you we are created in God's image. I am the daughter. I am the son of the living God. It means also my words are living and are active. 